Well, anybody that wants to be involved in any part of the automotive repair industry, whether it be body shop, whether it be uh, automotive service technician, we've got heavy duty programs. So there's a lot of different options that students have depending upon what they want to follow through with. But once somebody's decided that they want to be in the trade, there's a number of different routes that they have for which classes they can take. We've got some of our co-op programs, we've got the TADA program, we've got another Chrysler program as well. And these are more of a full, well-rounded program where they're going to take English, they're going to learn some communication skills, they're going to have some knowledge about the whole automotive business. We also have block programs where they're going to come in for eight weeks, do their schooling, return back to their uh, placement or wherever they're serving their apprenticeship, and then go back and forth between school and the other. And when they're done, they're going to fill out their booklet, and once that's signed off, they can go and write their license. So you don't have to be fully licensed to get into the trade. There's a lot of different options for students. The equipment that we have is state of the art. In most cases, it's going to be equal to, or in some cases, better than what they're going to find out in the uh, real repair shops. Uh, dealerships, we've got equipment that's on par with what they have and depending upon the speci specific program that they're in we're going to have dealer specific equipment as well. Uh, the, absolutely this is used in our auto body techniques program this is used to give these students the proper gun control before they actually start spraying real materials so they're going to use learn gun control how far away how fast and they're going to learn to get an even coat of paint on the panel before they even spray it a little bit.